Yeah, wonderful people, viewers and subscribers. I just want to be very quick on this. Um, just recently, last week actually, I got the, the information about Imo State gubernatorial election and the 25 million which Labour Party placed on their form. I spoke about it last weekend, but I never had time to publish it. Labour Party, this truth is for you. Beginning with your national chairman and all officers, both at the federal level and state level. Listen to this. If you think that you will become APC and PDP in Labour Party, just know that Nigerians are changing the narrative. The obedient movement do not allow it to slip from your fingers. Why am I saying this? Labour Party is almost becoming what PDP and APC had been. They are now selling tickets to the highest bidder. I am not a politician, so I'm not going to speak like one. Why should Labour Party be selling form, nomination form for governorship election? 25 million naira. Because Labour Party is now in the market, Abi. Because Labour Party is now in the market. Some people have now opened shop. So today, just yesterday night, I came across Peter B's tweet intervening on the same matter. Okay, people, I was scrolling down Peter B's Twitter page. Um, I came across a very interesting um, tweet by Peter B. Right here, he said, I thank the National Chairman of Labour Party, Barrister Julius Labure, and the National Working Committee for heeding to my appeal and reviewing the nomination fee for the governorship form downwards to 15 million. I applaud them for also agreeing to refund the cost of the form to the family of a diseased aspirant chief, Humphrey Amomodo, from Imo State and also agreeing to refund 10 million to each of those that had paid. He went further to also say that the, these gestures reflect Labour Party responsiveness to the yearnings of Nigerians. Just to let you know that this man reflects the mind of good and well-meaning Nigerians who thinks positively and how things should be done right. So that Labour Party will not be like the APC and the PDP. So that Nigerian people will not sell a dog to buy chimpanzee. Okay? So, with this very um, development coming from Peter Obi, stating that um, he's very appreciative of the National Working Committee and the National Leadership of Labour Party to reconsider that amount of money because we can't expect somebody to put in service to the people after expanding so much money just to pick a form and also to run for an election. These are the breeding grounds for corruption and we can't allow that to continue. And I thank God there is a man at the center of Labour Party and the obedient movement, that is Peter Obi, intervening in matters like this. And I can tell you, Nigerians, do not give up on this man. Everyone should rally around him. First, to make sure we recover his, the mandate Nigerian people gave to him and also continue on this obedient movement, this ballot revolution. This is just the beginning because we have a long way to go. A lot of shit we need to pack over the years. So help us share this video. Inspire more obedient Nigerians never to give up whatever you can do no matter wherever you are keep the faith alive keep the fire burning let no one convince you otherwise that your vote doesn't count and your pvc is useless don't listen to that narrative it is coming from the same people who are part of your problem their intention to commit this criminality in the name of an election is to kill the spirit of Nigerians that have risen up to retire them so that they will give up on the process. 
we are not giving up and that is our password to our freedom from bad governance i'm just a voice the advocate for good governance help me share this video and i want to help i want to ask you to help me extend my gratitude to the man of the moment pitobi we stand behind you i will continue insisting on the right thing being done bye bye for now